Okay, I want to show you guys. This is my Samsung Galaxy S2 running on the new XXLPQ ICS official firmware. And I'm in Canada, so it's not region based per se. And this is the international versions with the two home buttons. Well, I mean, with the back and the menu and the home button. And I'm just going to show you Quadrant running on it. But I'm going to optimize it quickly just before I run Quadrant. Just, just to make sure two cores are running when I run that test. Because some people don't show you that the screen can say only one core running when running Quadrant. So I'm going to kill a few apps here. This is going to run. I'm going to optimize with Android Booster. Close some more tasks. Free some more memory. whatnot. give this a sec so we're gonna clear some more cache and stuff we're gonna do a one touch optimizer and I don't need to clear the cache there because I did it in another app let's see if I have anything else We're going to go Android Assist, we're going to do a quick boost. I'm going to close, see if I have anything else here. And this is rooted, so I don't know if that affects anything to do with my Quadrant score. So I'm going to go here and just throw this here. We're going to do the test quickly. Just give me a sec. I'm just going to do one more optimization here. I can optimize that. Uh, grant. Close seven apps, cleared that. Okay, now we're going to go to Quadrant. We're going to go to System Info. And you can see the firmware I'm on. I don't need to show you in settings and whatnot. This is the showing two cores. And this, this is the Samsung official firmware to keep note. This is the one with the TouchWiz interface on it, not the real ICS, but. It's uh, it's TouchWiz on top of ICS, that's what it is. Now I'm going to run the full benchmark. I have nothing running in the background, no music, nothing. Well, that's on my computer side. I'm gonna see the results go, yes. So I get, I get a score of, focus. Get a score of 41.85. Thanks for watching.